Good morning, one, and good morning, all, and welcome to the stream. Sit down, relax, grab yourself something to drink. Welcome back to another session of Cyberpunk 2077. Alright, so we last left off at was it the diner? Yeah, it was a diner. We got our first tower card. Johnny, oh, <laughs> this is a, this afterlife on this arm. Tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there, welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drive-bys along the way? <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... Hold on, hold on. The streets are safe, you say, but what about the highways? I'm, I'm sorry? You heard about the shooting off a Route 1 exit, I trust. Mm -hmm. Half an hour before any response team arrived on the scene. Over 700 rounds fired in that time. What happened? Where are the gunmen now? Well, the NCPD is responsible for the safety and security of all citizens within city limits. Sarah, Sarah, but, uh, sweetheart, uh, don't one. feed us some NCPD script. Be honest with our viewers. When will they finally be safe? When will they no longer need to carry a concealed weapon for a trip to the mall or to take their kids to play ball in the park? Uh, I, the, the, the NCPD is doing everything it can. <laughs> Look at that cop squirm. Shithole. But I'll tell ya, grass ain't greener anywhere else. Don't believe me? Then it's time for Bullshit Bulletin. That's a yes, so there's the diner. Oh, I see. I need new shoes though. Talk to Misty, talk to Victor. All the tarot cards are already available, which is dope. Uh, we can do our gigs too. We'll travel by foot exploring this area. But when we're, going, when we're going to the next area, we'll go by car and then, then get out and travel by foot. Because now's a good time to go exploring. And if I'm right, the... Yeah, there it is! Is that it? Yeah, that is it. <laughs> this one's important. <laughs> we gotta do that one. It's really important we do that. It's just here. Side job. No, let's start with that. They don't look like tiger claws. Oh, that guy does. He's got a samurai helmet on. Oh, I've got to go around. Okay. Tarot card in here too. Might as well get it. Oh, that's right. It's in the afterlife, isn't it? This has been your report. 
called back up, crack some heads open, drag the body things. Go ahead. After life's all about breath. That oh, hang on. Mean a Let thing. me, uh... Doors are shut to us. That's that. There it is. I don't know why fam. Who would have thought? The Empress. Uh, I don't want a main story. I want a side one. I want that. Anything? Nah, I'm good, Claire. No. This trouble? The net around me? You won't. You know it. I lost everything. Let Through me be you. plain. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you your own shit. Room? Go fuck yourself. Hey, interested in some work? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? Oh, is this the dude? You ought to run this by a fixer first. Fuck the middleman. They're cash drained. Attitude like that won't get you far in this line of work. I don't need a consultant. I need a transporter. Will you do it or not? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah, this yeah. is where this is the dude who's at my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty free. Duty free and detail free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good. I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words "No future." Yep. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Thanks, Glenn. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. Chuma mine earned a spot on the menu here. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, I'm well, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. <laughs> That's right. In the drink's name. Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. I should definitely go for a drink. Tough day? I don't like any other. So, what'll it be? A Jackie Wells, obviously. There's a Johnny Silverhand. The David Martinez. <laughs> mm. You don't have the Jackie Wells. This is bullshit. <laughs> this is booming, I hope. Seeing it yourself. Can't complain. Folks always get thirsty, and we're here when they do. How's the afterlife? Working you and me. No real complaints. Fights are rare, and when they do happen, they're over quick. Killer clientele. Am I right? Your words, not mine. Hang on just a little longer, Chook. Ripper's on the way. There's a tiger claws.
Fuck off. Nice city, bitch. <laughs> Hello, coppers, don't mind me. What's going on here, actually? I got nothing! Didn't say you did. Boy, tigers come around here? Y'all ain't nowhere to be found! Shut your mouth, you little shit! Whoa! Look at you! The big bad police! Saving the damn world! One fucking pedestrian at a time! Yo, shut the fuck up! Better listen to your friend. Better listen to your friend. No, I see how it is. You just hate us, don't you? That's what this is about. Hate you? Boy, I couldn't give two shits about you. I was honestly expecting that conversation to, uh... Lead to him getting his ass beat, you know. Some nice stick up that dude's ass, bro. That would be, that would have been enjoyable to watch. Bows are so yet you got a cybernetic arm. <laughs> cool hands, bro. CP report. Definitely want to do that. What if I get a shortcut there? Maybe I can jump over past this roof here. Oh no, that's way too high. However. I know I can make that. Nice. Oh, I can just go through it. <laughs> Tarot card here too. Let me grab that real quick. Kind of work. That killed him in a single hit. Hmm. 
Huh, we actually did sever his fucking leg. Uh, gotta pay a little visit to another Troom who thinks he's too smart to pay back his ads with interest. Start off right uh, with a good whack to the jaw and if he stands his ground, do a full restock of his store. you get 10% of whatever you grab. He's here. He's... Hang on, I better get the cat. Here, all yours. Well, I saw good in you. God bless. Mm, yo, V, Watson's open now. You're f oh, that's right. I definitely like my revolver more. All oh, right, I wanted this one more. Give me that. Uh, these we sell. What's this? Power pistol. Oh, I do want to try to take double barrel shotgun. way for me to level them up I swore there was a way for me to fucking level them up Why 
is the main character so naive? What? Having a dream makes you naive. Are you even serious right now? There's no dreaming in a megacorp. I'll tell you that. So what are you doing at Karashi then? Realizing my ambitions. Are you wrong in the head or what? Clothes that I got, I just need to push. How's life? If I remember correctly, Tiger Claws are a threat here, right? <laughs> oh shit. He's in rough shape. But alive. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Find the package? You could have told me the package was a man. If it was a box of bananas, I'd use the post office. Get over it. Well, who is he? The ambassador to Mexico, Jesus, it doesn't matter who he is. I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to Northside. The address is in the GPS. Okay. One more thing. Watch for tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion. Wait, wait, wait what? A <clears throat> Asshole hung up. Enough back, but oh,
Not gonna lie, I do like the pistol more. Right there, Chim. I'm just only realizing now that the weapons that I've broken, you don't collect them, you disassemble them. Which I both like and dislike. Like because you get the components, dislike because, like, you know, you can't sell them if you already have the components. Thing. So strong it glowed for self warning.
Yo, Chu. Job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there, all right, Hariyoshi? They need to give me hope. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan, brain sergeant, top of all. Good to instinct. One day, Tiger Crow boss needs surgery. But both die on table. Tiger Crows were very angry. Oh, I hide yeah. in boat. Swim to America. I know this one. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I killed Tiger Crow boss on purpose. World best sergeant make no mistake. <laughs> Early warning about the tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me yet. I know, here. May this blade serve you well. His name just fuck. His voice just changed. Oh. What's your name again? Brain Sanjon to World Best. Good to instinct. Where are you from exactly? Brain Sanjon to World Best. Good to instinct. Don't make me shoot you. <laughs> My car's fucked, isn't it? That's right. I forgot about that. Yeah. Running. I'm not doing any net running. So let's do it. Let's head over to this gig. I'm gonna going? buy some new iron. A few dozen pounds. Well, be my fucking guest. Alright, what do you got, Shim? Oh, you got a tech sniper rifle. Fuck a fly in here, that's annoying me. Power SMG, another tech pistol. Smart, power, power, more power. A lot of power. Wait, did I get another one of these? I think I did. Oh, this one's got a mod on it. Wait, what, what did I just do? What? Oh, I dropped it. Once I enable comparison. Good chance. Negative five fifty percent bullet spread and weapons. Yeah, put that on. That sounds all gold and shit. I like it.
God damn. I wonder if I got any more iconic stuff. private numbers. Yo, V. There's this badge. He needs help with his investigation. Guy's known for operating in the gray zone. No scruples about working with mercs. Attach more deeds for you. Hi, is Aaron McCarlson, NCPD sergeant. He used to work for me as a consultant on the show Cops and Chops Eight Seasons and is asking for a favor. Aaron's been digging into Maelstrom for a while now. It says he's found the warehouse where they torture people. But you know how, how it is for badges. Law slows uh, them down with mountains of paperwork. So if they want to get something done, they have to get creative. Aaron knows that, which is what, which is why instead of waiting for fat ass judges to grant him permission, he wants to get help from a contractor. Job simple: get into the warehouse, coordinate uh, coordinates attached, steal the security cam footage, and bring it back to Aaron. Should be enough to push his case through. And if that, if you happen to shoot a few Maelstrom uh, along the way, well, shit happens, right? Uh, world won't be worse off without them, that's for sure. So I can go loud. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Oh. 
wonder if I can get a stealth kill with this. Let's find out. I saw a blue thing to my left here. Yeah. I'll grab that in a second. Jack in here. What's this shit playing on the radio? Shut it off. Unfortunately, despite numerous uh, initiatives aimed at reducing our operating guests, uh, including extra commitment from our workers, we have ended this quarter with a loss. In light of these results, I guess so, yeah. A certain corpo entered the net one night when suddenly everything glitched. Then he encountered a red demon who said, Tomorrow at midnight you will be dead. The corpo did not pay any... Bloody scams throwing this email otherwise. Uh, it will kill me. Oh, is this? I think this might be Rebecca's apartments. Got the scrolls. Oh, V! <laughs> Thought 
bought you another one of those Serenity Bible whack jobs. Come in. So, hit any snags along the way? There always are. Handle them. You're real tough as nails, huh? That's how you survive out there. All right, now hand over those scrolls already. Choppity chop chop, huh? These scrolls are for some kind of investigation, right? Mm-hmm. Real big stink, mind you. But thanks to your help, I can give it a push. Here, take them. Great work. I'll spread the word you do solid merc work. Coming from Aaron McCarlson, that'll go far. I'm sure it will. Take care. Another million times. I don't want some stranger to hurt my little angel. Dad, us Moxes have each other's backs. We look out for one another. I'll, I'll get you an interview with my boss at the plant. I, you always dreamed of working with machines. Right. The same filthy, leaky machines that gave Mom cancer. Those machines? I'd rather choke on a stranger's dick than choke on those fumes. It's so dark, I can barely see him. Fuck, oh, game is more stressful than life itself. Is right. Gigs closed. Eddie's on their way. Cheers, fam. And I got a level. Fuck off. I've got to max this out for it to fucking. Yeah, okay. I should see a Ripper Dock soon. I want that too. I'll get that. I'll get that one next. A uh, corporate oppression will only end once you stop oppressing yourself. to offer my condolences. Mm. Offer your condolences? Ay, Jesu Cristo, v. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, B. We're definitely going. Right fucking now we're going. I need a ride. God damn it. Uh, 
where are you? This one. This is important. It needs to be done. I need to take a metro. I can take a metro somewhere. Oh, I could just... F oh, I haven't really unlocked the fast travel. And no, I want the metro. I want to take the metro. Yeah, there's a fast travel near me, though. If I take that fast travel over to here... This one, I think this one will be easier to get to. Alright, I've got to visit um, Body of Dexter the Shore to get that fucking weapon too. What are these guys? Are those animals? Oh, they are a sucker! What? Fuck off, you idiot! Arasaka doing here. Kinda tempted. I could not care less. Indeed. Time is money. No? What do you think? Exactly! Hang on, which is the one I want to go to? I want to go... There seems to be any metro stations near here, or that I've discovered. Okay, it's south of the... Uh, the thingy. Okay, here, the white line, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, the one, so we're following that now? Yeah, we are. Can't hurt you now have bad to the bone. Med center. Aluminum. Ours was made of aluminum. In extreme cases, even death. In response to... You'll never find them. Never. The mayor's office has raised the public threat level to red. Residents of Arroyo and Watson maintain a safe distance from the edge of the platform and always ensure easy access to protective firearms. Schools and hospitals have been closed until further notice. What's next for Pacifica? The district formerly designed as an oasis of luxury has become a den. Next stop, Ferrier and Ferguson. Express interest in the purchase of Pacifica property. You 
really can literally ride the train. <laughs> That's pretty Stand cool. Stand clear of the doors. Do not block exits. You're now at Farrier and Ferguson. So we're traveling up here now. Are we going to come down to here? Probably switch up over to here and go down here. So come down here. And this is where I need to be. Canine ownership tax will increase to 1,000 euro dollars per dog per month. Similarly, the fine for possessing an undocumented animal. Like a Delamate crashing my vehicle. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in to the N54 local news. Have a pleasant day. This is the latest thing they added in the game too. Being able to ride the metro. Next stop. Alexander Street. demonstrates commitment to eradicating the district's criminal presence. Today's final story is an unwelcome one for pet owners. The canine ownership tax will increase to 1,000 euro dollars per dog per month. Similarly, Jesus. the fine for possessing an undocumented animal will increase to 40,000 euro dollars. Next stop, Memorial Park. Park. The use of combat cyberware on this train is strictly prohibited. Don't make me get my mats plates out. <laughs>
now at Memorial Park. Where are we here? We are... Uh, maybe another stop or two. We should be able to get it. Next stop, Congress and MLK. I think MLK. maybe the next stop. Yeah, definitely next stop. Since we're gonna work together, only right to say hello. They call me El Capitan, and they call you me. See, no introductions necessary. I already took care of that. Someone mm. comes to me with beers, I take care of it. I eat, sleep, and breathe beers. Remember that. Aye, aye, Captain. While we're at it, you need fresh wheels, bikes? I got it all. Real good prices. So hit me up anytime, you hear? Sure, sure. Another thing, if you want to come and size me up, look me in the eye, uh, whatever, swing by, I'm here, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't curious to meet you. Hello, River Doc, I'll be sure to visit you. Oh yeah, this is David Martinez, River Doc, fuck yeah. Well, he's airy anyways. Yeah, uh, greetings? Pretty young looking for a ripper. That a problem? Depends. Not if your experience doesn't match your years. I worked ten years in an R&D lab at More Technologies. I hope that eases your nerves. You mind if I ask why you left? I got a feeling More Tech doesn't skimp out on its engineers. Sure, the pay was good. But I couldn't sleep. More, as you might know, specializes in deep tissue integration, titanium skulls, spine replacements. It's difficult work. It takes time before a new implant becomes viable, its implementation repeatable. Time. And lives. I'm looking for some new chrome. Of course. Get comfortable and we'll get to it. So we've got a new skeleton slot too.
Okay, might get spring joints. That's tempting. So what are these? Ten percent crit chance, that's not bad. This one I might get, because I already own it, I can just um, put it in. What is this? Crescent knock ends plus fifty percent. What the hell is Karen? Karen Zik? What is that? I don't know what that is. I like this one. Increased melee damage. And recharge suit my health items. I'm gonna get this. I, I can fit 10 more, but I'm not sure if what I actually want yet. Evidently not.
есть чем. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me, the truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced, but it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Sixth Street. Guys, ready, sir? About damn time. How long? How long's a guy got to wait? You requested quite a few modifications, but I managed to complete quickly as uh, as it is. Maybe even too quickly. I would prefer you have a little more time to check everything. It's a question of your safety, sir. Safety. Fuck that bullshit. It's got to work now, cause I got to race now. Uh, quit making excuses and tell me when I gotta come pick it up. We've, uh, we've already sent it. Uh, should be ready for pickup within an hour. offered you a job right now, you take it in a heartbeat. Who's gonna keep watching this shitstorm of a city if everyone starts signing on with the corpse? Come on, stay. Reconsider. Reconsider what? My paid vacation and health insurance? Do you even know the last time I took my little girl to the park? Sorry. You fellas will have to find a new martyr. <laughs> Smart move, dude.
Padre. Heard you're home. Already. You sure got that ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway, you'll need something. You know where to find me. Thanks, Padre. Clear, you don't need to yell. What's up? Doing a little competition. Shoot, prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. <laughs> yeah, that'd make sense. Well, you in? I didn't think big parties are your thing. Yeah, well, it ain't a big one, but, you know, running low on heads. Gotta bring in the clients, attract them and shit. Could try selling iron straight from the factory. Skip the whole part where you tinker for hours on each little shooter. V, my dignity, please. Mm. Sure, I'm in. When? Well, uh, right now. We'll wait on you. See ya. The pool table? We got to get rid of it. Really? He's pretty massive. So? Maybe we scooch it, put it up against the wall. Hey, James. V. Nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Been better, to tell you the truth. What is happening? That night, when Jackie fell. Let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. And a friend, uh, what's that exactly? Friends and family. We gather to celebrate the departed. Our memories of them. And we bring things they loved in life and might need in the after. Sure, some beard be at the top of Jackie's list. <laughs> and there will be beer. Want to take part in the ceremony, but want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket that would do justice to his memory. I, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. See ya. This is definitely bad off uh, compared to when you give it to Vic. Uh, the corpse just take it. Ivy. 
You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well... Human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. No, Jack was... a little of that, too. Always looking on the bright side. He wore his heart on his sleeve. And wasn't at all afraid to live fully. Had his inner demons, though. Who doesn't? Exactly. They're what makes us who we really are on the inside. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set. You two didn't get that far? He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things. Disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. Well, it looks like he swapped out the exhaust pipe. Hmm. What? I advised him to do it. Right before the job. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. That's definitely why they're up there. Yeah. <laughs> For whom the bell tolls. Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times. Always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? <laughs> Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm-hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. Jackie loved to pump iron. Didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. 
They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Gotta be hanging here since 2020. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it's a miracle he never wiped out. <laughs> Locked. I wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere? Bet you it's in the book. Hang on. He's gotta be somewhere. There it is. Found it. Oh, Jackie. Is that a mandala? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle. A home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was... Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, Minnie. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. <laughs> Jackie's favorite tequila. Still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. What? The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. That actually might be a pretty good tribute. Leather belt. Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. It's gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Something came up. There. Oh, that's the belt on. Jackie, my man, you won't believe your luck. A collector selling a beaut in premium condition. Price is good. If I little over the budget, let me know if you're interested. Because if you aren't, it'll go to someone else. Peace, Sid. This Saturday, the boys are competing for the World Heavyweight uh, Championship. Siva and uh, Blanco, beers are already cooling in the fridge. Don't forget about our deal. Blanco's wins by KO in the third round. He 
You better have the eddies not letting you off the hook this time. I vouch for you and V. Uh, he heard about you, remembered you all too well even. Uh, he'll want to meet with V, but I think it'll be a formality to see you, in the, see you at the afterlife. Can I take this thing? I think he'd like this. Alright. So we can take the tequila bottle might actually be a bad one. Don't we're definitely not taking the belt. The boar's kinda tempting to The book he reads before the gig. We won't we won't choose that one. I think the tequila, honestly, it was his lucky charm, and it's like, very rare. Yeah. Taking this, yeah. Perfect for Jackie. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Can we take both? I'm gonna take the ball too. Hmm. This'll be fitting. Yeah, and we'll take the book as well. Jack. Pure and simple. The only thing that's left is the belt and we don't want that. Uh, I guess, actually, should we take the belt? Fuck it, we'll take the belt. As True well. memento, this. But my first choice is definitely the tequila, if I can only put one thing. Thanks for the scratch, my friend. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Well's way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? Mama Wells, don't you dare put up a fucking scene, I swear to God. I'll see you at the Coyote then. Come here, big boy. Now's not the time, boom. This is a touching moment. We're mourning our friend. Not now. My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. P. It's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. Hey, V. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times. 
just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He bought some goods clipped from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. <laughs> A lizard. And, uh... I remember what he said then. That I came from a place where everyone's family. So he must be too. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Hard on his sleeve, he didn't overthink things. He just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. A Haywood kid with a mission. A Haywood kid with a hell of a drive. Rest easy, Chew. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. A lot of people come today. 
Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, B. Hey, Vic. Campos all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one miss. of his own. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after do. you die. <laughs> Me too, cabron. Not today. Me too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should... Mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Would you another? For Jaquito? Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. Poor. For Jackie. Dude, we're gonna get so sloshed. <laughs> Amen, brother. Ready, three shots in. <laughs> hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible book club. Yeah. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. Sure. All right. Why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. Good for now, thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Aye, right, give me a break. All right, let's go. No, I wanna talk to the Padre. I think I saw him upstairs. I like the Padre. Hey, champ. You, uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own? Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us? From up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. <laughs> Jackie, uh, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. How are things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. I'm gonna move on. Go with God.
Lupe's been handling their loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. Jackie chose his friends well. See you, Jackie. That's the first time seeing that. Not bad. Okay, unlocks bolt shots. To fire a bolt, release the trigger for a ch for a charge shot right before it fully charges. Okay, that when we hit level three there. Now there's actually something that I can get if I skip time. If I wait a full day. Now you're able to um, get Jackie's guns. So th uh, there I was talking uh, to my ex and I told her pass me the ketchup uh, for my fries and she has the nerve to say say the magic word while well, I reached over in my pocket and <laughs> have a good There they are. You heard what Kevin said. Take a fucking walk. You fuck off. Or I plant my blade in your ribs. Just try, Gonk. Come on. Let's see what you got. Well, just go real fucking into it. Yeah! <laughs> Landed a little trouble. Cleaned up. God damn, I'm sorry. I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because you would have caught a beat. Or worse. 
this fucking town, these people, just here, minding my own business. If it weren't for you, I'd... Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh, bartender got the rest. Good trip. Circling him like sharks on a scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. The good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years, man, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, Red. Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only I question is, who oh, will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. And no more than an evening's work. And you know, sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Well, guns, I got them. I'll show them in a second. One night, she wasn't even there. Besides that, well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Why you want to know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gun question is that? Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. Breaking up a happy marriage. You're gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Like at this city. Wait. But today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And now. Uh, she had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero. Means a lot to me. CD bars, betrayal, a beguiling woman. Sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. <laughs> Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story. An unfaithful wife in a city where everything is uncertain. You about done. I'm trying to focus. <laughs> this is like one of my favorite gigs because of fucking Johnny's comments. on the scene looking for the woman in the pink jacket the woman with a sordid past stop right there <laughs> okay pink jacket blue purse I remember having trouble finding her the first time It was her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. <laughs> Dreamed the day the narrator put a fucking dog in. <laughs> Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know.
Yeah, I'll show you off the guns real quick. Yeah, these bad boys. Yeah, they're both power pistols though. But they're Jackie's power pistols. I'm gonna be holding on to those. That's a tech pistol, I might try that out. That's a tech sniper rifle, I might try that out too. Get rid of that though. Uh, I don't like that, so let's get rid of that too. And that's my old tech revolver, so I can get rid of that. Get rid of the power revolver too, alright. I thought you meant our Jack. Nah, nah, nah. The woman looked around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. Keep this up. I'm a fucking puke. Narrate that. is a bum, gives him a wide berth, doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. Oh, seriously, wh what did I ever do to you? <laughs> a coyote? Me? <laughs> I resent that. Disappeared into the guts of a building ready to collapse. The air hung heavy with smog and betrayal. Ugh, maybe it's a good thing I'm dying. followed you husband sent me suspected something what? see who's right no it's it's not like that I I can explain go on then let's hear it okay for for one thing he's not my input he's my ripper a specialist in plastic surgery a specialist in this dump look I know I I had this little accident a few years ago. The victim, uh, well, the patient's family still can't let it go. That's why I'm forced to work here. Hold on a second. Uh, what about your kid? Here's the thing. I... Oh. I didn't used to look like this. I had a total body sculpt. Skin, hair, eyes, everything. Except, well, you can't fool your genes. That's why our son looks different than Pepe imagined. It's not because he's not the father, just that I... I don't look anything like the old me. But why? Why do that? And why do you think? Out of boredom, because I was a rich, basic bitch? Everyone's got their own secret. Something they want to forget or leave behind them. I... I had a lot of them. 
and I can't share him with anyone. Not even my own husband. I know I should have told Pepe about all this, but there was never a good time. And, and now that I'm expecting again, it, no, it, it, it wasn't, it wasn't planned. Please uh, tell him, tell him that. Yes. I don't know. I don't know what to tell him myself. That, that I'm really sorry. That life's an absurdist drama. Okay, just, just go. Hit the nail on the head with that last point. Hey, Chip. All right. Hey, in case you're looking, I'm at home, couldn't focus on shit, standing and wiping glasses like a fucking robot. Something comes up. Job's done. Followed your wife. Went into some rundown pad. Man was waiting for her inside. I knew it. What else? Knew it, huh? Didn't know a thing. Didn't cheat on you. At least, not in the way you think. Huh? What way then? She was at a ripper's getting a scan. Her skin, hair, eyes, it's all implanted. Every single last part of her. So, my son, that's why he... Exactly. Jesus fucking Cristo. How could you keep this from me? Her own husband, ten fucking years. It's not about the skin or whatever, it's that she lied. How the hell am I supposed to trust her now? Okay, yes, Cynthia was hiding something from you. Yes, she lied, but the woman loves you, you gonk. You know how much that means in this fucking town? If I were you, I'd just live and let live, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I guess you're right. Anyway, thanks. This is for you. For your troubles. Good man, Pepe. Take care. Silence fell like a wet blanket over Cat the city. <laughs> cries. Time to rest, I thought. Time to drink. See? That's more like it. Finally making some sense. Yo, Chum, what do you got? What's new around here? What can I say? Tensions are flaring up. Suits over in Corpo Plaza don't like that their view looks out over all us ordinary working class people. Something's coming. I can feel it. One firebomb and all of Vista will go up in flames. And next morning, they'll hire us to build new offices on top of our burnt out units. Thinking of buying some iron. You're thinking sound. Won't get far in Night City without any. Okay, what are you selling? You, that's a power. That is a power. That's another power. Power. Although you're on it smart. Oh, no, this is a tech, but I don't like that tech revolver. Anything here? Power. Smart. Power, another power, another power, another power. Schematics wouldn't be a better thing to invest in. Electrical damage. Frag grenade, that wouldn't be too bad to buy. You got some pretty cool shit. Let me buy these. Let me buy these schematics. Fuck it. I got plenty of fucking money. Uh, 
Thanks, Chip. Universe. If you're looking for a taste of paradise, don't wait a microsecond longer. Alright, I'm gonna make a phone call real quick. Give me two seconds. Sorry for your ride, Jackie. I forgot that RB is in handbrake. Tried to drift that. I really like doing these NCPD things because you can actually get some good weapons out of them. Like schematics and shit. Are those animals? Yeah, the animals. No! 
Who the fuck are these guys? What the f- Who the fuck were these guys? They just straight up attacked me! Were those tiger claws? So sorry. That didn't work out, did it? This is awkward. Oh. <laughs> Good eyes of the gong, that shithead, fucking chubby chip. Uh, so what are you waiting for, your mom? <laughs> Need to know you paid up, what else? But I already sent the creds to your boss. Well, I gotta hear it from him then. Alright, boss confirmed. Uh, going after the gong, and we done, gong's dead. So it was a hit.
yeah sure just blame me uh do you or do you not have those bds that went missing from the club i don't how many times i gotta say it i'm running out of patience you're running out of patience what about me what the fuck's uh my back pay you're no longer an employee damn right i'm not because you, you fired me but i got a few docs here says you, fu uh, you fucked over larry maybe i'll just pop by the station and see what the ncpd thinks how about that you're making a big mistake uh, that is you've made a that is you've just made one so why the fuck did the tiger claws just attack me for no reason Sandy Bisman bitch is crazy. It's a hit squad after me. Looks like I've pissed off too many Tiger Claws. <laughs> no, no surprise. Sandy Vista News is fucking me up. I really need a better Sandy Vista. Saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? I grab the scan, take a look. Tarot. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. Uh, the what now? Major Arcanum? Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. <laughs> Either way. You're saying some higher power's talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. <laughs> well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand? from a power I know nothing about. I'd start by looking for more of them. 
The tarot describes a road, so go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Thanks. Yo, Vic! My chew. Listen, don't laugh, uh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town, like murals or something, but I know they're not real. Uh, just a Kiroshi blip. Could take a look. No, no, the images are too complex for a blip. It's like they're symbols. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle the data overload. Either that, or it's reached the cortex. <sighs> Can you do anything? Nope. Better find a way to get rid of that chip. Thanks, Vic. Appreciate you. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Bit 13 again, good. Mm, I got the nervous, I got the nervous system one that I want. I do want a new Sandy Vista, not gonna lie. Oh, I can't upgrade it actually. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna put the other one on. I, I do like that one, this one more. The slow time I like more, but it doesn't do as much damage. It does increase my crits though. So I'm gonna find a better one. I'm gonna up, I'm gonna use this one. Jumper one sec duration with this cyberware per attribute point. Current one point one second. Is it, uh reflex attuned? I might get the blood pump. Do you think that'll come in handy? How do I see my total mitigation chance? I'm 
I'm gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna get the blood pump. Fuck it. I'm sure I can put something more useful here instead. I could put the armor thing on. What does this do? Ten percent mitigation chance when stamina is above eighty-five percent. Ah, this increases my strength of my mitigation. Okay. I'm gonna play it in simple 10.75% crit chance with blades and throwable weapons. So it's time for 30% for 30 seconds. Armor. Armor. So you think the skeleton one is the way to go for now? What do these do? might get that increased in mitigation chance. I'm gonna get that. That will help. Another three gem bonus, panastric shade damage, health item effects. I definitely like this one more. Right, and I'm then, and I'm also gonna get the mitigation strength next. Thanks, Jim. Uh, Minotech played out as I hoped. Thank you, and remember, we don't know each other. Shane was starting to like you. <laughs> no tell, motel, first floor, come alone. <laughs> there we go. Uh, we'll do that next time. But for now, I am going to have to end the stream here because I am up on time. Alright guys, well that's it for me today. I will be back tonight for some Dead Space. Honestly looking forward to playing that game. Unless it's too hot. Because like, uh, like I mentioned before, when I'm playing horror games, I close everything off so I don't get interrupted and I don't wake the neighbors. Uh, and if it's too hot, closing all the windows and doors and shit is a really bad idea because, you know, Australia. So yeah, with that, I am off. So I'd like to thank Boom for coming in the chat. I'd like to thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Alright everybody, take care and have a good one.